So what is happening? This is a blue, blue. Not blue, blue, blue. Look at them lashes, lashes, lashes. What these is happening? Guys. These are my guys. Hi, Dosha. Hi. Hi. Oh, she's saying hi to me. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. These are my guys. I love them for their lashes and their talents with the rhythm. And the way they look at me, you see that? Perfect man. I love it. I love them, man. Don't speak. Don't speak. Just let me read your eyes. Okay, okay, okay. So can I can I do my job again? Thank you so much! <laughs> they look you, good in that blue, baby. Here's the problem. They you look and I so shiny and moist. You and I could never fit in because we have the gift of gab and they're silent. So Uh well let me tell you something. I've heard them talk. They just was quiet around you, girl, but they talked to me. I feel like I have a, <laughs> that's, that's not a good, good impact. I'm just saying, not to make you jealous or nothing, but they was talking to me. I, I'm not wearing blue. Hot freaking pig. Oh, they only okay. talk to people in blue. I, I mean, come on. Okay, okay. Those booties look good in it. Okay, can I just, I feel like this is kismet right now because Keith Urban's on stage and he has a song called Blue Ain't Your Color, but blue is your color, girl! Yeah, blue is my color, it baby. It is your color! I got a few colors. I tell my body right before I put it on any outfit, uh -huh. this is your color. Now act appropriately, body. Wear your color. And you got the eyeshadow it's from head to toe, babe. She ready. She ready. I love seeing you here in Sin City. How excited are you to be? Like the action, I mean, you bring the energy, but being backstage, seeing old friends, making new friends, how is it for you? It's fun for me. Okay. Look, I'm a little social butterfly I know. when I'm outside. <laughs> and so I'm having a great time meeting people, talking yeah. with everybody. Yeah. And then, yeah, and then I'll be like the WB frog when I get back to my room. Yeah. <laughs> so what do we have to do to get you on the bill next year to be on stage performing? Um, just ask me and I'll do it. I have several songs that I could perform. Yes. And then, you know, I'm dropping my EP very soon. When that EP come out, baby. You have a whole set list right there. Hello, she ready. Can I just tell you that I've had Woman Up on repeat? And Woman Up. I can't say my favorite line because there's a little, little word in there. Yes. It's got a little it's booty. Get yes. your booty back in check, basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but yeah. girl, I, like, I feel it. The empowerment. Mm -hmm. What drew you to that song in particular? Well, first of all, Diane Warren and I were talking about the kind of songs that I want to make. And she was like, well, what do you want? I was like, you know what? I want a song that when you hear it, yeah. you can go, damn it, that's me sometimes. Yeah. And you know what? I do need to woman. I need to get it together. Mm -hmm. I'm a woman. Yep. I am strong. Mm -hmm. I outlive men for the most part. Yeah. I mean, look here. I, I never met a man mm -hmm. that has bled out of his body uh -huh. for more than two days and lived. <laughs> but us women, uh -huh. we are uh -huh. super creatures. Mm -hmm. We can bleed for months yep. and never die. Uh -huh. The only lyric that you have missing in that song is pull your big girl panties up. I know, well, we tried to put that in there, but it didn't hit. It Volume didn't hit. two. Volume two, next song is called Put your big girl pen is on. Okay, now, now we, okay, now I gotta get like a manager in this because I believe I would get like a writing credit, right? Like that's how it works. Nah, nah, my grandma used to tell me that all the time. I'm already, I'm already disputing it. She's I'm already, trying. I'm already disputing it. I learned that in the music business. Dispute, dispute, dispute. She is cutting me out already. You could be in the music video. Okay, I like that. I'll we'll have you that. putting on some big old yes. granny panties that go up to your chest. That's all these spanks are anyway. Oh my God. Exactly. Okay. I know you, between the acting and the singing, you are booked and busy, and the book writing, and I mean, you, I mean what can't you do? But what about a runway model? I think you have a full career ahead of you, girl, after girl. that New York Fashion Week moment. Girl, first of all, dream come true. Uh, was it really that was a dream come okay. true for me. I have, like my grandmother used to be a model oh. back in the 1950s. She was one of the first black women to be on television, yeah. modeling clothing and stuff. Cut to, you know, I'm telling my girls about, oh, this is my dream, like telling Kathy and Paris would be my dream to model in something like this fashion week. My grandma would be so proud of me. Oh. And then they started daring me. Mm -hmm. And I was like, don't dare me because I'm gonna do it. I will do it, especially if you're gonna make a donation to my foundation. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. It doesn't compromise my morals. I'm not hurting anybody. No one's getting hurt. Like, 
Yeah. All the models are, are yeah. already the last ones hitting the corner. Yeah. Well, they saved the best for last. Let's go. Yeah. And I rock, and I rocked it. That Monse suit was so bomb. And now they're gonna be dressing me for a few other things. Oh, and I'm about to works. go to Paris. Oh my God. Paris Fashion Week. Here I come. My favorite though is like you can say Kathy Hilton helped make my dreams come true. Exactly. I mean. Exactly. <laughs> Dream check. Like I have a long oh, list. Yes. A very long All list, right. and now I can check that one off. We were just with Will Packer last week, so I have yes. to ask you. He said, and you you girls have always told us, everyone's down, everyone's ready. He said they are working on a script, so I want to know how often do y'all bug him for updates? When is it ready? When can we when can we pack our bags? Literally. I don't think any of I don't think any of the girls bug him but me. <laughs> I think I think I send out a group text okay. message like guys, should I activate now? And they're like, girl, relax, relax. And I'm like, no, I'm gonna call them. And then I'll be acting like it's something like crazy going on and then I'll be, so is the script done yet? It's right, right, right. Did you like it? How's the outline? Can I read it? Can I give some suggestions? Okay, I have one last question for you. Diddy made a cameo in Girls Trip. You have, of course, starred in a music video of his. What are your thoughts on what has transpired this past week? That you never know what people are really into. And um, it's none of my business. But I value the advice that was given to me by a few people earlier in the game when I first started doing stand-up back in 1996. I was told, don't be the last one to leave no party. And if you start seeing people leaving in droves, you get out of there. Don't stay after 1 o'clock unless these are your close, close friends. And so. Every time I go to a party, like, I'll leave. When I start seeing a lot of people leaving, I'm like, well, I guess it's time for me to go. I gotta get out of here.